Well, I'm back with another video. Now, if you if you follow my channel, it usually has to do with uh, outdoor adventures. You know, on the trail, hiking or camping or winter camping. You know, and I'll do some reviews on some gears that I have. But one of the things I talk about on my channel quite a bit is uh, Mimilus. Now, what I have here is a 50 liter dry bag. I don't usually use this out in the trail. This is mainly for canoes, you know, and this is not 100% dry, but because it does have the zipper on it. But this is a 50 liter dry bag. I have 100 liters too, other ones. But right now we're talking about the 50 liter dry, 50 liter dry bag from Mountain Equipment Co-op Neck. And this is how I store my clothing. So that's why this here, I'm gonna call this Extreme Minimalist Clothing. Some title, I don't know what kind of title. We're gonna, we're gonna come up with a title. So, and don't forget also, if you want more information on this or, or to help out the channel, please subscribe to the channel and also give it a thumbs up. The thumbs up helps quite a bit because the more thumbs up I get on the videos, the more people, YouTube will recommend it to other people to see. So this is extreme. Now you'll see this in van life quite a bit. You can't take all your clothing with you. And I see a lot of people, they still install a closet in their van. So, and they hang stuff up. I, I, I don't hang nothing up. There is nothing hanging. My clothing is very simple. Well, I think it's simple. So what we got here, like I said, 50 liter dry bag. We're gonna open this up. I'm gonna show you how I store my clothing in here. Got a little zipper here. There's not much in this. This is just miscellaneous stuff. Like I said, there's not much in there. So one thing right off, I store them in Maxpedition. You can get these, now you can get different styles of these. They don't have to be Maxpedition because Maxpedition is pretty expensive. There's other versions, but what I found out, the other ones tend to uh, stretch out more or less. They don't, like when you open these up, they'll kind of, they're a little, they're a little different. I just wait. I, li I just like really. I like the way these ones are. I never tried any of the other ones. I'm a Maxpedition, you know, kind of like Maxpedition. So, as you can see in here, if you look real quick, that's it. Just the way they're sitting in there. They're all. It's just the way I do it. Now this here usually just sits over in the corner on top of other dry bags. which have camping gear in it. Most of my dry bags have camping gear. And there's another bag like this that carries my uh, winter winter clothing. I only have, I have two bags. So two of these, that's all my clothing. It holds, one holds strictly, strip, uh, strictly my winter. This is my summer, kind of. So right in here, we'll get right in here. Right in this bag here, it's simple. One, two, three, four, five. That's it. The way these are folded, that's five pair of underwear in there. I could like to get another set. I could get another pair in there. It's, it's just the way it is. If you compare that, like, the way they fold, now all my clothing is merino wool. So I find the merino wool folds down a little smaller. And I just like merino wool. 80% of this is merino wool. I wouldn't buy nothing else. So in this one here, you got another one. You know, another Max Edition. It's like the medium, I think, this one. This is the small, medium. These are the older versions. There's different versions you can get. And there, there's likely another one in my, my winter one. Maybe we'll do a separate one on the other one. So we'll just stick to this one here for now, but look. So in this one here, same thing. I have a, in the top, this little top right there. Just a pedal case, spare pedal case. In here, I'll keep my washcloths. Like I'm telling you, this is extreme in loss and towels. Now I do not use, that's another thing, I do not use a full size towel. I use the medium ones to dry off with. It was another video I came across, you know, watching YouTube. So technically I have four of these. I'll have, right now there's one set in the bathroom. There's one of these in the bathroom, one of those. That's what, I, that's how I do it anyways. This one here. This is my uh, socks. One, two, three, four. There's four pair of socks in there. That's all the short shop. Now these are the, these are the ankle socks. Just to let you know the ankle. You know, these are the ankle ones. And you, these are these. 
You don't care if these are wrinkled. So they hold all my ankle socks. Simple. And when you get into one of these, these are the large Maxpedition pouches. Unzip these. And that's it. That's how it is in there. So if you're looking in here, there's a pair of pants at the back that it fits perfect. One pair of pants. I'm not sure if these are the zip offs ones or not. I do have zip offs. These may be. And they could be the brand new pair I just recently bought way back. So I got sure. I got one, two, three, four. Oops. Got a pair of shorts right there, actually. So there's a pair of shorts I stuck in there. And these are two, uh, the, the muscle. What are they? You know, I, I never wore these, actually, these two shirts. <laughs> they were on sale really cheap for Marina Wool, so I got those. So you got one, two, three, four. You got four shirts in there, five, six, technically. Let me go into another one real quick. Some people don't like these, but these work. These work great. They only work great if you roll your if you're rolling your clothes. So you know you got another one. There's, they come in different colors. Not that I ever remember what I put in them. There's only two I ever grab out of here for t-shirts. So this one here is a little different. Open this up. So when you open it up. You can see that. Now these are like a mesh. These here, uh, I'll show you real quick. These breathe. This is not waterproof. There's a, there's a, this, this will breathe through here. So as you can see right here on this one, you can see one, two, three, four, five, six. I got six shirts in this one, and I could still fit another one in there. So there's room enough in there to squeeze another one in there if I want. Another pair of pants at the back. And then you can keep going here for you know, what's in it. And, uh, so. As I take in the stuff out, my, my bag is collapsed. Oh yeah. So in this one here is a little different. And I, I if you look at my clothes, they're they're all both the same color. Like either now on this one here, it's black. And that it's it's kind of a gridstone uh, heather, which I like. So I keep my clothes pretty well. I, li I like earth tone colors. I'm not much into color. Like you'll never see me wear a bright red uh, shirt. Or bright yellow, no more. <laughs> I have in the past, but no. So I got another pair of pants back here. So I think I have four pair of pants. They're all the same with the zippers, you know. So in this one here, no, this one here is not t-shirts though. These are long sleeve. So these are the same ones that I would wear here. They're the same weight. I think they were 130 weight, lightweight, but they're a long sleeve. So these are all long sleeve. One, two, three, four, five, six. That's more than enough. That's an overkill. Already went in that one. What's in this one? So yeah. So when we get into something like this, there's another one. Now I'm, I have a little bit too many socks again. So on the outside I got socks, but they're kind of stuck down in. I got two pairs of socks. They're kind of stuck down that sleeve right there. So inside this I have two other Maxpedition uh, pouches that fit in there. These are the medium. So, as you go in real quick, this is where I store my socks. I got one, two, three, four. That's eight pairs of socks in there. That's eight pairs. It's just the way I roll them. It's organized. And, and not only that, I have another, another one that's in here. This is my first uh, icebreaker socks. You can't even get this, this color no more. That brown, you can't get that. And these ones in here are actually all brand new. These these have not been worn. It's because they were on sale at the time and I kept buying them and I couldn't find the ones I was looking for, so I kept following their website. Like I said, I have them in here. I have a pair on, plus I have one, two, three there. Another one inside this bag. So uh, I'm a little over, I got too many socks. I know you're, you're thinking you need like 50 pairs, no you don't. So yeah, so. Right now, I'm not even wearing these. I'm actually uh, just, I keep going through the ones I have right here. It's crazy, don't you? And all my socks are the same. I think these are a medium. They're just a different color. I had the blue, I think the blue, or the black, they're black. 
for the blue stripe in these, but they're the same uh, weight. I think they're a medium. And they're all marked with left and right. So if you look right here, I've shown this before, left and right. Now I don't fold my socks. Like, you know how you have them this way and you fold? I don't. I The way they fit on my feet is the way I try to keep them. I try to, you know, flatten them out that way and roll. You know. So I kind of flatten them out. So, and then I just roll. Well, we don't roll these ones because... <laughs> Cause they're not going in that bag they're going up here so they got to stay flat a little over killing the socks by the and on this side here we've got on this side yeah so on this side here this is where i have button uh, another pair of shorts there's another pair of shorts in, in there there's two more shirts now those shirts this is a merino wool shirt this one's not but i'll show you that so this this one here's my test subject I, I'm, I'm testing this shirt right now because this one's a collar shirt. I'm gonna see how many wrinkles are in that. I'm not gonna unroll that yet. I have a piece of plastic that's rolled inside that shirt to keep the wrinkles out of it. So far, if you have a button-up shirt and you do it this way, you gotta, you gotta put a, a heavy piece of plastic in that, and I mean a, a good size of uh, plastic in there just to, to prevent it from uh, to wrinkling it. It kinda helps. say this is for extreme minimalist only this is so and that's how I do it and then now this here check this out and again, kind of guess what that's for eh? my caps I'm not a big cap collector I think this is my second one right here the one I have on yeah I've already thrown one out because they get stained so quick when you're hiking this in here then I got this one you know I have worn this one and I kind of like the mesh now. The mesh, it's, it's, it's what I go for now. I only have like three. I have three in there. You know, got my icebreaker one. I'm a big fan of that one though. It just, you know how hats are. They just never fit really. Then I got another North Face. This one's getting wore out. So the one I have on and this one, they're gonna have to go soon, especially this one. But uh, I'm a big fan of the mesh now. It's just, I found it was cooler to hike in. More in the winter time, I'd wear something like this where it's a solid. Which, which I find not too bad. But really now in the winter, because I shaved my head, I just wear a tube. <laughs> so this one here is still in good shape because this one was ordered not too long ago. But I don't have one of these. And I don't need a lot of hats, so they'll all one, two. I got like, what do we have in there? I think you can fit six or seven hats in there. I can fit quite a bit. But like I said, I'm not a hat collector, so I don't need that many. That's just a hat protector. I like this. This thing really saves the hats. That way I don't worry about hanging my hats up. It goes right in there. The only thing I did do is I cut the zippers off. And I put these pull tabs on because I don't like metal zippers dangling around. So other than that, that's it. That's my uh, that's my clothing. Oops, that is there. Real quick, so and that's it. So that's pretty well it right there. So if you're ever thinking about, and the best thing about this, so if I'm going out now, I do have another, in my other uh, bag, I have another one of these, but it's a white one. It's a, it's a different Maxpedition. There's already clothes in that. So there's already a long sleeve shirt in that and a short sleeve. And there's also a pair of socks and underwear. And that always stays into my camping gear. And it's a little, slightly little bigger than that. Not much though. But so this is how, how I do my clothing. I fold and roll, fold and roll all the time. So at any time, if I have to go out and change my shirt, or if I was going on a trip somewhere, I can just pick from this. The best thing about these, this is what I like about these, when you pull one out, and zip it, it's right there. I don't have to pick through uh, different levels. So if I want that brown one, I grab the brown one. If I want the black one, I grab the black one. They're all rolled the same, shorts, shorts are there. You know, on well, that little tiny, tiny muscle shirt there. Grab it. Pants, pants are on the back. They're already full of rolls. 
you wouldn't be able to do that with a pair of jeans like these in the back. That won't happen. Not that I own a pair. I got rid of my jeans. I just I don't find them comfortable. Not for what I'm doing. For hiking, you've never hiked in a pair of jeans. You're crazy. I mean, you can, but, you know, there's another shirt. That, that's what I like about this. It's, it's simple. Same thing. I think this is my long sleeve one. Just talk about the weight of it, yeah. Like I said, this is all my long sleeve shirts in here. You know, I gotta grab one, run and go. It's just so convenient. And if you don't have these, you know, if you don't have, if you get a few of these, because these are expensive, it takes time to, like I just didn't go and buy a whole bunch of these. I only bought two or three at a time, then you buy two more. But you can stick that in a Ziploc bag. You know, it's already done. You don't have to mess around. and. The way you do it, there'll be no wrinkles on it. You take your time. Now, I find merino wool doesn't wrinkle as much as normal clothing. That's like I said, but that's all merino wool clothing except for those pants. So that's a that's a quick, and then the top here. You know. So there's another pair of socks I leave in that zipper part up here. But way too many socks. Like I said, I got carried away because when I went to their, their website, they when I went back to their website, they were uh, they didn't have them in no more. The, I don't know, maybe they were popular, the medium, and they were sold out. And I kept looking so every time they went on, but when they went on, I, I got them at a deal. So I kind of got lucky in that in that case. So other than that, this is how I store my clothes. <laughs> like I said, this will help you out if you're into van life or. Or if you're just one of those people that that are constantly on the go. If you're constantly on the go, this is the way to do it. If you're uh, especially uh, if you're moving all the time. So this is the way. This is what I do. You know, this, this, it took a while to get there, but I'm kind of happy with this the way this is now. Like you gotta say, that's all all my clothing right there. Well, and maybe we'll do another video. I'll do a separate video on the winter. The winter bag, it, it's no different. It's, it, it's the same as this. It just has winter gear in it. So I never have to go into that one. So usually all my winter gear gets washed, puts away. I don't touch that. This is my this is my summer gear. And I have another one for winter gear, two bags. Two bags, and that's all my clothing. It's great, I love it. Well, don't forget to click the thumbs up. I really appreciate that if you do. And don't forget to click and uh, subscribe if you haven't subscribed to my channel. I usually throw these minimalist videos in there once in a while, just in case somebody's interested. But, like I said, it'll help you. You can get rid of some clutter. You know, we, we, we have too many clothing. We, we have way too much clothing. Like, how many times have you gone to your closet, and you pull out your shirt and you put it on, and you go, yeah, that still fits. Looks good. And you throw it back in the closet. You never wear that shirt. You never wear it. That's what, and that's why you'll see me mostly in uh, black now, or not black, this is like a heather, gridstone heather, or those browns. You're gonna see me in most of my videos in those because that's all I carry. The odd time you'll see me in uh, the light gray, and there's one blue one in there. The only reason I kept that blue one is because I just bought it. I took a chance. I don't know if I ever wear it though. <laughs> so I kind of went just to these. I like black, big fan of black or the gridstone heather anyways, or black, uh, you can see. You can get these in different colors. Like I said, you may not be able to get this now, because when I'm on their website, the 50 liters are no longer, they're no longer available, the 50 liters. The 100 liter is, and the 150 liter is, and there's a 30 liter that's available. The 30 liter is pretty small though. This just works for me. So I hope, I hope this helped, if anyone's interested anyways. That's the way I do it. Well, later.